What's up guys, Lethal Leslie here and today I am bringing you a video on the weekly objectives guys and how to get those players or that player in particular, the team of the season player for as easy as possible basically because some of them are a little, pretty tough to do and this week is no different guys. So let's go over and have a look at the weekly objective and this is the card we're talking about. This is the card we're going to be looking to get, guys. He is going to be, I believe, 89 rated or higher. So he's a pretty high rated card. And it's one you're going to want to get, guys, to rinse into those Bundesliga Team of the Seasons. Because they look insane. So anyway, let's get into it, guys. To do this one, you need to score a goal with Liga Nos players in five separate online season wins to earn Team of the Season Musa Murega. I think that's what he's called, guys. And so that's pretty tough. You need five wins to do this one. And I'm going to go with, through a few tips that I think will make this a hell of a lot easier for you guys to do. So first of all, let's go over to online seasons matches. As you can see, I'm currently sitting in Division 4, guys. And the first tip I'm going to give you guys is drop divisions. If you're someone who cares about your record, then what I would say is that's a shame. We're really late on on FIFA here, guys. Why waste your time trying to grind it in a high division when you could just drop divisions? If you're looking for time efficiency... I would definitely recommend dropping down to those lower divisions, guys. Anywhere from 7 down, and if you're a half-decent player, you're going to be able to pick up plenty of easy wins. So that is my first top tip, guys. Make sure you are dropping divisions. It is so important to doing this, and it's definitely something I recommend you guys do. Now, the next thing, and this is probably one of the most important things as well, these two tips together will make this an easy card to obtain. Um, let me just select a fresh squad here, guys. There we go. I've called this one weekly OBJ, guys. And what I'm going to recommend here is that you make a squad using a certain level of player. And that what I mean by that is you want to make a squad that is good enough to win. But you also want to make a squad that has a very, very low rating, guys. So the, the second tip is straight up go to your bronzes. And if you don't already have very low bronzes, go and buy some low bronzes, guys. Because bronze, uh, bronze benching in the divisions is super, super important to do. And obviously, the thing is with this is you need wins. So you can't do it with someone else like last week and trade off goals. You need wins, guys. You need five wins. So the most important thing is, first off, make sure you have a seriously low bench, guys. And then, of course, you're going to need some Liga Nos players. So let's head over to the Liga Nos and let's have a look what's on offer to us, guys. So I wouldn't be, I'm personally not going to be using Jonas or Dos. They're both good players, but both neither of them are good enough for us. And we want to look for players that can do a job for us, guys, really. Like, you know, the Dumbias of this world are probably a good example. He's already up, as you can see, to around 8K. One thing I would say is don't rush it because these players will come back down in price as well. That's something you want to keep in mind. It's not worth going and paying 8k from now when you'll be selling for 4k in a couple of days or even maybe a couple of hours, guys. Um, for the wings, you've got yourself the Gelson Martinez's and stuff like that. And after that, you know, if say you're playing like something like a 4-3-3, guys, get your front three in there because all you need is one goal scored by one of these players. And then after that, just build your sweaty squads, guys. I would definitely be going sweaty then. Maybe looking for your Eric Bailly, Virgil van Dijk, Sweaty Prem players, stuff like that. So I'm going to go ahead and build a squad that I recommend you guys should use for this right now. And this is the squad I recommend you guys use. Something very similar to this, guys. As you can see, the rating is only 76. It's pretty low. Maybe even if you wanted, you could get maybe one or two silvers in there or something like that, guys. If you think there's any B silvers, just to really bring that rating right down. Um, and if you're still getting hard teams like this, like I said, I suggest you even lower your team to even worse team, guys. Um, just like I said, maybe get some silver fallbacks or something like that. In. And if you drop down to the lower leagues and use a team like this, you should be able to do this within one division, guys. If you're good enough, you should be able to do this within one division. It's not really hard to do. It's only five wins. And with that attack force, that um, sweaty back line and midfield, it should be pretty easy to do. So I hope this has been relatively helpful for you guys. Not the easiest one to be helpful on. Not, not even close to as easy as last week to be helpful on, really. But in, at the same time, I do think this is the best way of going about it. Make sure you're dropping that division. Make sure you're using a very, very low-rated squad, guys. And make sure you've just got three attackers. Don't pay for all of them. Otherwise, you'll be paying through your nose. Get those sweaty players in and get this one done. Get that player in and use him in Sunday's SBC, guys. Hopefully, we get someone good in the Benders League one. So, I'm going to leave this video there. If you liked the video, like the video. Subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching, as always, and take it easy.